Assalamu alaikum, my dear students and viewers. How are you? Hope you are very well by the grace of Almighty Allah. I am also fine, Alhamdulillah. Dear students, welcome to my class, English second paper. This is Anwar Hussain, assistant teacher, Birgams Pilot Gopt High School, Birgams Dinaspur. Dear learners, let us watch a video and get how about it? Here is a video. You watch it attentively and guess. Dear students, you listen and see it attentively and guess what about it. Yes, you say right. Today we shall discuss about voice. You write down the topic voice part one. Dear pupils, after the end of the lesson, you will able to, you will be able to say the definition of voice, right kinds of voice, realize the definition of active voice, explain the definition of passive voice and quasi passive voice. Number five, sense verbs and objects. Dear learners, what is voice? Voice is the form of the verb which indicates whether the subject does the work or something has been done to it. Dear learners, I give you Bangla meaning for your help. You can write down it and or collect it. Dear pupils, how many kinds of voice? There are three kinds of voice. Number one, active voice. Number two, Passive voice, number three, quasi-passive. Number three, quasi-passive. P.C. Dash, a renowned writer of English grammar, said this classification. Dear students, what is active voice? Or what do you mean active voice? Active voice is when the subject of a sentence is doer or action, the verb is in active voice. As example, I eat rice, here subject I is active. 
for this is active voice. This is active voice. What is passive voice? Passive voice is when the subject of a sentence is acted acted upon the verb is in passive voice. For your help, I give Bangla, I give Bangla meaning. You can write down it. Here, as example, rice is eaten by me. Rice is eaten by me. Here the word rice. Here the word rice is object and active here. But subject inactive here. Object active, subject inactive. This is passive voice. This is passive voice. Dear viewers, next page. What is quasi passive? Number three. Quasi passive voice is active in form but passive in sense active in form but passive in sense as example honey taste sweet here sweet word is complement in passive sense we can say honey is sweet when it is tasted. Honey is sweet when it is tasted. This is quasi passive. Dear students, let's for a table of person it is very important for changing voice. You must write it. Table of person. You know, person, first person, second person, and third person. Here, First person, singular form and plural form. Singular subject form I, object form me. In plural, subject form we, object form us. Second person, singular you. Subject form, object form, you. In plural, subject form, you, object form, you. Third person, singular, he, she, it. Subject form, him, her, it, object form. In plural, they subject form, then object form. My dear pupils, you need another chart. Verb patterns of passive voice. You must write it. Here, tense name auxiliary verb, 
principal verb past participle participle that's been third verb preposition by to it object form of pronoun number 1 present indefinite tense auxiliary verb will be am is are for the passive voice principal verb third form preposition by here yeah, object of object form of pronoun number 2 present continuous auxiliary verb am being is being are being principal verb third form preposition by object form of pronoun present perfect auxiliary verb will be have been has been principal verb third form preposition by here object form of pronoun number 4 present perfect continuous auxiliary verb have been being has been being principal verb third form preposition by past indefinite tense auxiliary verb was or principal verb third form that's mean past participle form preposition by here yeah, object form of pronoun number 6 past continuous tense auxiliary verb was being or being verb third form preposition by number 7 past perfect auxiliary verb have been had been sorry had been principal verb third form number 8 past perfect continuous auxiliary verb had been being principal verb third form preposition by object form of pronoun here number 9 future indefinite auxiliary verb shall be will be principal verb third form preposition by number 10 future continuous shall be being will be being auxiliary verb principal verb third form preposition by object form of pronoun number 11 number 11 future perfect future perfect auxiliary verb shall have been will have been principal verb past participle preposition by object form of pronoun number 12 future perfect continuous tense auxiliary verb shall have been being will have been being principal verb past participle preposition by object form here yeah. object form of pronoun my dear learners the structure for the passive voice is very important 
you must write it and practice it again and again. Let next page. I hope you understand my discussion and I ask you some questions. Dear students, Abdul Rakib say what is called voice? Correct. Thank you very much. Abdul Rahim. How many kinds of voice? Yes. Correct answer. Clap, clap, clap. Rina. What is quasi passive? Thank you very much. Correct answer. Dear learners, all of you given right answers. Congratulations. My dear students, ready khata and pen. I shall give you a simple home task. Write it and will will show me next time. Write the verb patterns of passive. Dear students, if you like my class, please give me like or write comments. Stay at home and always keep you neat and clean. No longer today. Thank you very much. Allah Hafiz.